Good morning, fam. This is your boy Abe. Back in the gym again. Doing a 30 minute cardio. We walk for 20 minutes on the on the treadmill. We finish it up for the cardio on the bike. Get our heart rate up. It's important that you get your heart rate up to the peak levels so you can burn the fat. It's real important. Day two. What's up, Facebook? Day two just begins the 30 minute cardio workout, two minute warm down, and head to the weight room. Deuces. Day two of our workout. What, 14 more weeks to go? No, a long time ago. Tired but motivated. See you guys soon. Alright. Fam, this is End of day two, as you can see, I'm exhausted. We did a real workout today. We worked on back and biceps. And remember, we're not professional trainers. We're just everyday people in here trying to work out, trying to be the best we can be. So get in there in the morning. Try to do your cardio if you can. If you can't, do it in the evening. But get some kind of cardio in. If you can't get to the gym, go outside and walk in the evening. And if you can't get to the gym and do weights, Walmart has sets of bands, and you can do the band work at home. Remember, do what's good for you. Start off slow. This is only day two. You don't want to hurt yourself. Remember, be the best you can be. All right, how's it going, fam? This is Abraham, Dan, and Sydney. We're back at the house. It's real important that after you work out within two hours to get some type of protein into you. So what we do is we make our protein shakes. And I'm going to show you a little bit of what we use daily for our routine. Uh, we usually get up in the morning, uh, within two hours of waking up, we try to get something in our stomach. So what we've been eating is oatmeal uh, with some kind of fruit in it, a little bit of honey, and we take our fat burner in the morning. Uh, the fat burner we're using, and I don't endorse any particular fat burner, you can use whatever ones you want, but the ones we've been using, because my son turned me on to them, is Hypercuts. It works for us, it doesn't keep us jittery, and it helps gives us the extra energy and boost we need to get through the workout. Uh, in the morning also, we make a, uh, an endurance drink for us to go work out, the particular kind that we use. Um, this is a multivitamin, uh, multivitamin, multimineral liquid form because it was hard taking them big pills every day. So, and it comes with the pump. One pump is your serving for the day and we put this in our endurance shake. Um, another supplement that we take is uh, really important that you need to take all the time. This particular one is called Omega Thin, and this is Omega-3 fatty acids. This is what your body really needs. It helps you to burn fat, and it also helps uh, your cartilage and your ligaments to stay fluid so you can work out real good without getting too sore. Um, one of the things that we put in our shakes is a green superfood. Uh, this has spirilla, cholera, uh, plankton, um, seaweed, and a lot of other various different things. Um, and we put this in our smoothie daily, uh, only eight ounces. We also use what you call uh, Demetrius Earth. Actually, it's little organisms that help clean your colon and actually help clean your uh, your blood vessels. So it goes through and it scrapes the wall for that built-up plaque that you have. We also add a little bit of this into our shakes every day. Uh, the next one is it's a green papaya extract. Uh, you guys can do the research yourself and check it out. It's a really good superfood. Uh, you'll see the benefits of it. Do a Google search, you'll find out what it is. The next one is a Moringa leaf powder. They call this the super of the superfoods. Uh, do a Google search and you show it. Uh, it'll show you exactly what it's used for. Uh, you can use this to mix it in teas. Uh, we use it, we put it in our smoothie after we work out so it goes right into our bloodstream. Um, I stopped personally drinking milk uh, about 30 days ago. Um, I only drink almond milk now. And you can make your own almond milk just by getting a cup of almonds and putting two cups of water to it and put it in your blender and you can make your own almond milk and put it in your refrigerator. It'll last for a good about a week. Uh, but the kind I've been using is the Blue Diamond because we've been working out and we're in school a lot, so this is just a good way to use it. And I also use coconut milk, coconut milk and almond milk. That's what I drink now. Um, we have um, a 
whey formula that we use. The particular one we got this week was Metrex, and I'm not endorsing Metrex. This is just the particular one that was on sale because we're just starting out, so we just want to make sure we're getting some type of protein in. My wife takes one scoop, I take two because I'm bigger as you can see, and this is the one we use. Um, now really I'm going to talk about the blender. This is something that you're going to get, you're going to have to get. Um, this is a Blendtec. Uh, the blender is a little bit expensive. It's $399. Plus if you get the extra size jar, it's going to be about $450, $500. $500. But it is worth the money. If you're going to be making smoothies, if you're going to be making sauces, if you're going to be mixing or blending anything that you're using, especially to work out, you're going to have to buckle down and save and get the money for this. We have another blender that broke and I had to send off for one. I don't know where the other one is. But we tried to use a regular blender for two days and it just did not cut it. You have to use this as a high speed blender. There's two of them. There's a Blendex and a Vitamix. Either one is really good but you need a really good high powered blender. Um, and in our shakes we put in two cups of strawberries, two cups of ice, uh, we cut up a banana put in here, and also a tablespoon of ginger. And I'm going to go ahead and make the shakes now. Uh, we start off, I put everything in, the bananas, the ice, Don't forget that ginger. Do your research on ginger. It's really good for you. So we go ahead and put the ginger in. I put in about a cup of almond milk. About a teaspoon of the Demetrius Earth. Put in an 8 ounce portion of my green superfood. You can find this online. Get any one you want. Doesn't have to be 8 ounces. It's really important. This is you get all your servings of your vegetables in one scoop. And we'll move into the moringa leaf. You only want to put about a tablespoon. Not too much. About a tablespoon in there. And then, same thing, about a tablespoon of the green papaya extract. There we go. Then I'm going to put two scoops of the whey powder in. And, of course, it looks like my son took my scoop again. So I'll get one. Oh, yeah, this is... Uh, the Dimitase, this is what we use for our endurance drink. We drink this while we work out, and we put our vitamins in here. It helps us to get through the workout, because as you can see, I'm still burning. I'm still soaking wet. I don't put this in, in our protein shake. I'm just getting a scoop out of here. We put two scoops of Metrex right in here. That's where we get our protein. We like strawberry. I'll leave it open because I put an extra scoop in mine. And on our blender setting, we go to extra large smoothie. And it's an automatic, and you just hit start, and it runs it through the cycle. Okay.
as you can see this yogurt is just like ice cream it'll be cold I'm gonna add another scoop in because this is the other one that I'm gonna drink I happen to drink more because I'm bigger I need to put a little bit more almond milk in here because it's a little too thick or you can put water I keep them I buy them by the case I'm going to put a little bit more almond milk in here to thin this out just a little bit. And run it through again. Signing off. Deuces. Welcome.